Hi, my name is Kimberly Gandler. I'm the sport biomechanist here at the Memorial Hermann Ironman Sports Medicine Institute. For the kcal per hour determination, we are going to tell the athlete how many calories they're burning at each intensity of exercise. So just like a lactate profile, we're going to start really easy and work our way up, and each of the stages is going to be three minutes. We're taking the same oxygen consumption, CO2 production data, along with heart rate that we are for a VO2 max test, but the stages are much longer, and we're using the information to then figure out how many calories the athlete's burning rather than just give them a VO2 max number. This is very useful for Ironman athletes that are training for longer distance, helps them know how many calories they're burning so that they can properly take in food to recover and during exercise. This can be done on the bike or the run. The bike, we control the wattage. The run, we control the pace. Here's the data from a kcal per hour test. So we're showing at each one of the wattages that the athlete rode at um, exactly how many calories they're burning on a per hour basis. So if they go, go out on a you know, two hour ride at 200 watts, they're burning almost 800 calories an hour. Uh, this one right here is showing the, all that same data only broken into total calories, fat calories, and carbohydrate calories. So you can see here that athlete is burning primarily carbohydrates as a percentage of their total calories. And at the higher intensities, they actually burn no fats. I'm Kimberly Gandler. Thanks for watching.